Oh, how dare you? All right, time for another stem. And then we have just the bit on the way out the door, I believe. Which is like two or three, I'm not sure. Oh, four. Ugh. Now you saw me. Woohoo! Oh. Yeah. Take that, you rodent. Oh, there's another one over there. Crap. All right. Kill that turn. Got to go back over there to get that guy. That's right. I'm going to be a completist about this part. <laughs> Don't squeak at me. I was going to say, I swear, if I miss this one more time, I'm just going to run off over to this guy. <laughs> okay, so, using that, well, we can see this guy. He's just not in combat. Or in range for me to see, apparently, character-wise. get this guy going. I'm so confused. Did I not aggro first? He must have aggro first. Because uh, I aggroed and then he walked over to me. So, And I'm not checking these corpses because honest... Oh. Well, I'll show you with this one then. Honestly, there's no real point to check these corpses. As you can see. Um, in Fallout 1 and 2, rats really don't have meat. And of course, anybody who knows rats knows rats have enough meat, but they are small, so I'll give it to uh, these guys. And... You guys never got a chance to see it, but, oops, uh, I do save a lot. We're going to save it in part one. That's going to be where we go back to next week. Oh, look at that. I don't know this yet, but that's Shady Sands. <laughs> this is, I love this because you have this entire map. And uh, as we play, you'll see that map can get quite big. But this is your quick spot where the various things that are on your map will show up. And then you can hit that button, and instead of having to go and look for it on your map, you'll then 
be able to go there that way. Um, gonna do that. And yes, I did go straight to Bolt 15. Anybody who's played Fallout 1 is probably really upset with me right now. Guys, I'm doing this for the people who haven't played Fallout 1. So if you've played Fallout 1 and you're upset because I didn't go to Shady Sands first, that's so that the people who haven't played the game can actually see the actual way to go. <laughs> Oh, come on, he's right behind me. What do you mean? How close did I need to get? <laughs> okay, and then I'm gonna go around this way to get these guys. Gotta make sure we get them all because we don't want to have to worry about being attacked when we come back out. I just had to check to make sure I unmuted myself after that utility break. I don't know how many times I've either been muted or haven't quite plugged my uh, headphones in and didn't quite realize. But it's been enough that I now paranoidly, paranoidly, it's a hard word to say, check to make sure you guys can hear me. <laughs> ah, die, you dirty rat! <laughs> you dirty rat, you killed my brother! <laughs> Hell in the wastes, these rats could have killed my brother. <laughs> uh oh. Oh no. Let's see. Hmm. Well, first, let's try science on it. I can't... What, it's right there. What do you mean I can't get there? Oh, that's because I was still in combat. Duh. <laughs> I failed to learn. <laughs> what happens if I hit repair? It does nothing. I don't see any big guys yet. I'm kind of ill prepared to deal with the big guys. Oh, crap. There he is. I was wondering where the hell he went. I just realized I forgot to uh, stem. So I'm going to go ahead and use that stem. Wait, which ones are these? That's the regular jacketed hollows. Oh, those are the armor piercers. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm unloading that. I'm going to put the armor piercers in there because that's the first thing I want to use once I do get to that. I'm going to go ahead and let him come by. What's good? Okay. All right. So I'm going to need to use this with him. 
And I wish that I would have more stem packs when I do it, but that is obviously broken. Yes, I did already know it was broken. And since the elevator is broken, we then, of course, have to find a way down the elevator. I'm not going to worry about killing the rest of those yet. All of the rats can uh, just stay cozy for now. What I'm going to do is now I'm going to go to Shady Sands. Now this, is, of course, is the only other place we know of so far because we saw it coming up when we were passing it to go to 15. Oh, crap. Okay, so there is quite a trick to get the rad scorpions. Rad scorpions are so much worse in Fallout 1 and 2 than in Bethesda's Fallouts. So this is what I call the shoot and run tactic. <laughs> Everybody has a tactic like this. Everybody who's uh, played any kind of survival game has a tactic like this. Because there's always something that is way too badass and you have to shoot and run or else die. <laughs> oh no. Maybe run, run, shoot, I guess. Oh, no, let's just run. <laughs> I would like to be able to kill these guys because uh, I need some trade goods. So we are going to try to kill them. Oh, sorry. I did not mean to hit my mic and make such a loud noise for you guys. Okay. Now with this Fallout 1 and Fallout 2 as well, it's got an interesting menu. We can actually look to see which one we've shot already this way. Instead of having some fancy bar. That one's wounded. That one's unhurt. What? I was shooting at two different ones. Maybe I missed. We're going to shoot him. And of course you want to make sure you hit. I missed. You want to make sure you hit. Boom. Missed. <laughs> okay. And because I am brand new right now, um, I do have to look at my character. I don't think I leveled up. But I will look here and as soon as we get to Shady Sands to see. Thank <laughs> you.